Hello everyone and welcome back to more MDK. It's time to keep disrupting the boss's movements by continuing to pump bullets into him until he gets sick of it. Are you sick of it yet? Come on. Come on, boss. Have a cow. That's one of my sister's favourite insults. She likes telling people to have cows. Even males. Even that's a bit hard. But hey. Sometimes insults don't really make sense. Have another cow. It's almost like a greeting. For M MBK players, you know. They just stroll up to each other and say, When's the last time you had a cow? And like, oh, it's been ages, man, I know. So bearable. Well, here's the solution for you. Have a cow. Have some health. Me giving no indication about what we're meant to be doing does no help whatsoever. Blue beams aren't very nice. You, that's enough of that nonsense. Let's give him a thumper, shall we? Thumpers! Thumpers! Oh, baby! It's thumped. Oh, that's a blue laser beam guy. Do not like you, blue laser beam guy. Mm -hmm. No. Threw an accidental hand grenade there. Just because. I literally have very little idea about what I'm meant to be doing. Oh wait! Nope, eventually he did get, get sick of it, and he's now fallen off. We can now jump up his little spire! It took ages! Way too long! Way too long! Finally, let's go down the hole, shall we? Down the portal of glory, into the tubes of the alien creature. I see, and we have what appears to be... Oh, it's our friend, Bones! Hello, friend! Anthropomorphic dog creature! You are our friend. Free Bones by feeding Gunter. Apparently that man is Gunter. That evil guy. So all we need to do is apparently need to push this button. Okay. We have a Gunter snack. We have more Gunter snacks. <laughs> I like the taste of snacks. He's immune to sniper bullets now. He's finally gotten over them. It's good to see that he's curbed his habit of sniper bullets. That man down there is annoying me, so I'm just going to throw that. Yeah. Alright, what's up here? I need more boost. There's a snack. Do not respawn. Oh wait. There's the world's smallest nuclear explosion. That man causes obscene amounts of damage. Okay, we've got the world's smallest nuclear explosion. He's eating his thing. Then he doesn't do much else. I see. Now he spits out a baddie. Don't like that. Go over to that thing. Uh, 
There's a world new small sneaker explosion, and it does nothing because I missed. Ah, it's dropped another nuke. Excellent. I like the bulletproof shield. That is an improvement. Forgive me if it takes a small while to figure out how to defeat this particular boss creature. I am aware that I am on quite low amounts of health. Alright. Come over here, boss. Enjoy your snack. And I shall take your world's smallest nuclear explosion. Go away, enemies. I'm on 13 health. I don't like it. Alright, snack man, have a snack. Let's try this world's smallest nuclear explosion thing again. Aha! We dropped the world's smallest nuclear explosion on that target there. Seemingly doing nothing except activating the other fans. And I assume that's good. I assume that is good. We seem to have another item dropping now. I assume it's just going to be a case of dropping more and more items off. Until we're happy, you know, we've done the things at the top. Because it seems that he gets very distracted by his food. Allowing us to grab the world's smallest nuclear explosion, very quickly run off up a vent. So that's what we'll do. We'll keep distracting him and then run up vents and drop nukes on these targets. We need some more snacks. They're like Scooby Snacks, except they're for Gunter. I think they may have accidentally like had a go at some races there by saying Gunter. But hey, maybe it's a a pre-plug, you know, a reference before the actual original thing existed, for Deus Ex. That's quite possible. Have a snack. Okay, we've got the world's smallest nuclear explosion. Now, make this nuclear be small. It actually does deal damage, the world's smallest nuclear explosion. Oh, look, the dog has dropped. Oh, and he's not happy. What's happening now? He's jumped into the bowl of Gunter snacks. Oh, I see, he's cleverly disguised himself as a snack. How creative. Well, let's see what this does, shall we? We've freed our little anthropomorphic dog. Now an anthropomorphic snack. Cleverly disguised. Have a, have a go at that. What do you think of that, boss? Tasty. Don't chew, just swallow whole. That's good, that's a good boss. Oh, and here, what's going on, enemy boss? Oh, you can't quite stomach that, can you? No! Mm. Oh, you exploded! Leaving your ribcage and an anthropomorphic dog who's going well done. You fed me to the evil boss! And guess what? We're happy about that. And a dummy decoy comes in. <laughs> Thank you, dummy decoy. Holding Bones' little craft. Ah, uh, isn't that nice? And guess what? 
we're loading the end of the game. We might as well watch it. We're, we're here. We have completed the game. I won't make it another video. We'll just watch it as is, shall we? It's loading. So now we fly away in a nice pre-rendered scene even. Oh, we're dropping an airstrike on it. Oh, that's satisfying. What's happening now, eh? That's how you defeat evil bosses, by the way. You new can you new keys? So you get a pat? Wait. Got some video happening. Personal file access. In DK. What is this? It's a good parachute, isn't it? I'm not really quite sure how to react to this at all. I certainly can't understand it. Can you understand it? Strange, Kurt. That was strange. That's quite frankly the strangest ending sequence I've ever seen. And I'm not kidding. That was just strange. Um, well, I hope you enjoyed MDK. That was weird. I'm still freaked out. I well, hope you enjoyed MDK. When we come back, even more um, other games. Something less strange, I think. Um, MDK. Yeah. God bless everyone. <laughs>